how about changing our perception about anger and instead of seeing it as this like bad scary thing like oh my god it's evil and I'm gonna I, I can't I can't possibly look at myself I'm a terrible person how about seeing it as hey this is an opportunity for change because really the energy of anger is not the problem it's the story I make about it it's the, my relationship to anger it's the fact that I'm thinking like I, I don't want to accept this I, I, I want to cut myself off from it I want to deny that it's a part of life see anger is just there as a little nudge a little it's like oh I'm, I'm off balance so now I just need to find my balance it's our body letting us know through this vibration of, of what feels like anger to let us know we're not quite in alignment and we need to find balance a cautionary side note about anger anger is such a powerful emotion that you can either you'll have people who are afraid of it and afraid to express it or can get addicted to it and it makes them feel powerful if you're starting to project anger onto someone it's telling you something it's telling you that maybe you don't feel important enough that, to that person. You don't feel like a sense of significance of who you are. And therefore, you're trying to get their attention through this sneaky, manipulative way. So we just have to watch out for that because I know I'm guilty of that. Just ask for what I need. Just say what I need. So embrace anger. Embrace it as a friend.